All right, YouTube, hey Josh here at Columbia Company. Check out this post train pole bar building right here, 30 by 60, 14 feet tall. All right, in this short little video, I'm gonna share with you some of the highlights on this building here. All right, you can kind of see here, we got four overhead doors right there, 12 by 12. Again, that metal, actually that's a 26 gauge. Now you're probably asking, what's the difference between a 26, 27, 28, 29 gauge? All right, 26 gauge, a little bit thicker. All right, designed for kind of light commercial. Kind of depends on the post frame pole barn building setup. Now that roof right there, that's actually a 29 gauge. But what I want to share with you, again, in this short little video, is the inside of this. But before I go inside and share with you the concrete perma columns, the rack bracing, and the drip stop, I want to share with you the diagonal view of this post frame pole barn building right here. Again, 30 by 60, 14 feet tall. One that we just completed. Now people ask me all the time, different service areas. Now we do business in 12 to 15 different counties in the state of Ohio, and we have five to six crews, okay? So that kind of gives you an idea. But let's take a look at the inside right here, the concrete perma columns. Maybe you're asking yourself, you want to have a strong foundation, but you maybe you don't want to pay the cost of doing concrete. All right, you can see right here, here's an option for you. You can actually do concrete perma columns. You can see right there. You can see that the base, and then you can see the three ply. Now this application right here has a three ply. Now you can get a four ply on that as well. Again, a two by six right there application, then you can get a two by eight as well. But you can see right there, we've got concrete perma columns. Now this is the state of Ohio. We go down 54 inches. All right, you can see the back fill right here, 401 stone. You see we've got that two by 10 rim board as well, but here's an option for you. Concrete perma columns versus maybe doing a four by six, six by six, three ply, four ply, or something like that. But a concrete perma column, a nice choice there. You get the, the strong structure of concrete, all right, but not the cost of the foundation, all right? So keep that in mind when you're designing, laying out, engineering, your post frame building. But like I said here, drip stop metal here, again, that comes with actually a 20 year warranty. It's got a fuzzy felt like texture there. It comes pre-assembled to the underneath of the metal there. All right. So you can use that or you can actually use a vapor barrier. You can see on this application, again, no labor because it comes pre-assembled, pre-applied to that underneath and that steel. So it makes it nice from a labor perspective. All right there. And you can see that double top beam header there. Got a little dirt on that one, but actually that's a two by 12. Again, a yellow pine. All right, not a Douglas fir, but I tell you, we've had Douglas fir come in before as well. Now we're located in the state of Ohio, so yellow pine, just a little bit more easier to access here. I actually get it from down south, but that yellow pine here, it's gotta be a hard species of lumber to support that roof truss right there. Again, 30 foot roof truss there, two by 12 yellow pine. But if you're on the Pacific Northwest and Douglas fir, you know, may make sense. And then also check out this rack bracing right here. See the diagonal bracing or rack bracing? Again, it keeps the building from racking right there. See that diagonal bracing as well. All right, again, post frame, eight foot on center. I don't say that, I think that's pretty elementary, but a lot of you out there may be new to post frame pole barn building, but actually eight foot on the sides. See that eight foot space increments right there. So short little video. And again, another one completed right here. And again, comments always welcome. Until the next one, keep it locked, keep it loaded right here. Attica Lumber and Attica Lumber.